Austrian Joseph Frank was an architect that designed everything from houses to chairs, sofas, tables, lamps, jewelry and vases. When Frank came to Sweden in 1933, he started working with Estrid Eriksson at the renowned company Svensten, where he fundamentally changed Swedish furniture design. At Sons 10, Joseph Frank was offered a total freedom which resulted in more than 2,000 furniture sketches and 160 textile prints. His objects were created in materials such as teak and mahogany and combined with textiles, rattan and bamboo. He liked to mix different sorts of wood for the same furniture. By using colored materials that were light and dark like different veneers, leather, skins and stones, he presented nature's irregularity, variety and soul in his many creations. Joseph Frank was born in Vienna 1885. He trained as an architect in Berlin. 1910 he started to design houses, both exterior and interiors. In 1921 the Swedish entrepreneur and designer Estrid Eriksson saw some furniture by Joseph Frank in a villa in one of Stockholm's exclusive suburbs. She loved what she saw and began to follow his production. At the beginning of the 1930s, Ericsson wrote to Frank and asked for design proposals. He quickly responded to the request and sent some drawings. With the Second World War approaching, he and his Swedish wife moved to Stockholm where he started to work for Estrid at Sundstam, and they became close friends. When the war got closer, Joseph Frank moved to New York. For Esther Dirksson's 50th birthday, he sent her 50 textile patterns. Many of them are still produced today. Joseph Frank was influenced by Windsor, Shaker and Egyptian chair types. For him, these movements often served as an inspiration and stylistic ideas. He further developed the design tradition, but never actually tried to change it. Joseph Frank died 1967, 81 years old. Hundred years after he designed his first furniture, people are still attracted by his classic, elegant and organic shaped furniture. In the last few years, thousands of Joseph Frank's design pieces have been sold at auction worldwide. Prices are rising in general, but the unique early work in cabinets and bureaus that are decorated by illustrated book pages, wallpaper or fabric are still the most sought after on the secondary market. Joseph Frank's status in the design market means he is a constant top search on Barnabys. The outstanding design and the items in all price ranges make us, Barnabys, believe that the demand for Joseph Frank will continue to be great.